Hey, what's going on folks? It's Miles here once again. And today we are going to show you how to commit a like and not like statement in SQL. Now we're using a Postgres SQL database. And like statements are sort of like sort of like where statements, but they're a bit more flexible. So basically when you're using a like statement, you are saying to the server, I want to find all the rows where some word or some string of characters is in that field. All right, so now we're going to show you how to do this. So here we have this table called cities one, and it's just a list of cities with their populations and their native language spoken in the city. So to do a like statement, we have to do a where clause where some field like some string of characters you want to, you want to query from that table. So say we want to query all rows from the table where there's an E in the city name. So we would type where name like, and then we would have one percentage sign on either end of the string, and then an E in the middle. So let's go ahead and type that. Okay, so here we just queried all the rows where there is an E in the city name. Pretty simple. Now we're just going to expand on this and add another like clause. And for this one, we are going to query all rows where the language name has an H in it. So as you can see, these are all the cities with an E where the language spoken has an H in it. And we can play around with this. So this gives you a little more flexibility when you're doing where clauses. Okay, so now on the other hand we have the opposite of a like statement which is a not like statement. So if we include not into this query, we are going to get a completely different set of results. So what this query is doing is telling the server, query all the rows where name does not have an EI in it and where the language does have an H. Okay, so that's how you perform a like statement and a not like statement in SQL. If you have any questions, uh, feel free to leave a comment, and I hope this is helpful to all of you. Thanks.